Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Just a Fun Guy. And today, I'm going to be talking about fast food restaurants. They're not the healthiest places in the world to eat, but sometimes you have no choice, so you're on the road and it's the cheap alternative. I eat my share of fast food, not very often, but once, once in a great while. I'm going to be talking about the five fast food restaurants you should not go to because they're extremely unhealthy. Before I get started, don't forget to leave a like and comment down below. Here we go! Number five is Arby's. Arby's may be one of the most popular fast food restaurants today, but it doesn't necessarily mean it's healthy for you. Arby's is mostly well known for their roast beef sandwiches. But one third of all the Arby's menu items, including some of the classic roast beef sandwiches, have trans fat in them. And their mozzarella sticks <coughs> have 2,530 milligrams of salt. That is more than the recommended daily value. Number four is Quiznos. Quiznos has over 21 sandwiches. There are over 1,000 calories. Now, if you're on the road and they have an eight hour drive ahead of you, I recommend eating there because that would keep you satisfied for a long time. But if you're trying to lose weight and trying to eat healthier, I wouldn't recommend it. Number three is what a burger. What a burger, 90% of their restaurant items on their menu has more than the daily recommended value of like one of six of the essential nutrients you need. So let's say one of the burgers has more than the daily recommended value of fats, breads, and oils, and the other one, meat and poultry. And that's not the uh, worst of it. <clears throat> one third of those items have a lot of saturated fat in them. Number two, Carlos Jr. Carlos Jr. is bad for you in two ways. Not only are their commercials exploitive to women and bad for your soul, they, uh, their burgers are also bad for you. Six of their burgers on the menu items, including breakfast sandwiches like these, have six grams of trans fat. So I would recommend either eating breakfast at home or ordering one of like their uh, barbecue sandwich or have a nice grilled chicken salad. Number one is Sonic. Sonic is on this list mainly because of their burgers. Over 10 of their burgers have over 1100 calories. And that's before the sides. All the sides have at least one gram of saturated fat. Are these fast food restaurants unhealthy? Yes. Am I saying you should never ever go eat there ever again? No. It's okay to eat at these restaurants every once in a while. Like if you're on the road or you're running low on funds. You just shouldn't eat there every day. Every day you should eat healthy, get a little bit of exercise, and not eat your recommended daily value in one sitting. I'm just a fun guy, signing off. So long, YouTube. Hi everyone. Thank you so much for watching my videos. I really enjoy making them as much as you do watching them, so stick around for more content. Don't forget to leave a comment down below and like it and subscribe and share and do all that good stuff. Well, once again, my name is just a fun guy, and I'm signing off. So long, YouTube.